what's not. Congressman French Hill, Republican Congressman from Arkansas and House Financial Services Committee, Majority Whip. Good to see you, Congressman. So let me ask you about mortgage interest deduction, because it concerns millions and millions of Americans who rely on it every year. Uh, there is a story today that that perhaps as a part of this plan, taxpayers will be forced to choose between property tax uh, deduction or home mortgage interest deduction. Can you elaborate or do you know anything about this? Well, David, thanks for having me. I think that's uh, jumbled uh, information. In the uh, framework that the Big Six announced last week, the issue of charitable contributions and interest for a homeowner's mortgage interest are still included in the plan. So I don't think that's uh, I don't think that's headed down the right the right trail. Is is there any uh, provision about whether you have you can take uh, deductions on multiple properties? A lot of folks have a summer home. Uh, some some questions about whether they'd be able to take the deduction on both homes. Yeah, I think that's still under discussion as the details of the framework are put in place in terms of uh, personal residence versus an investment property on mortgage interest deduction. And also, I think the committee is still listening to those uh, uh, representatives from high tax states about uh, the deductibility of state and local taxes or, mm -hmm. in that instance, uh, uh, state property taxes which, as you know, obviously is a sto state and local You know, tax. I'm old enough to remember the debate in 1986 over second home interest deduction, and it was, it was a row, and the people who advocated eventually lost for considerable reasons, probably the same reasons it'll lose this time. But let me just ask about another question, the fourth, mm -hmm. whether there's going to be a fourth bracket. We know that President Trump's plan has three brackets. Question about whether there would be a fourth bracket on the wealthiest Americans. Do you know anything about that? Well, I think the idea of a fourth bracket is still under discussion in the Ways and Means Committee and the Senate Finance Committee. I think President Trump's goal and the goal of the big six working on this project is that all Americans get a tax benefit. Uh, we want people to get a tax break on their personal taxes no matter where they live. And so uh, that's the main objective of the plan, but mm. it's still under discussion on whether we're going to have the three consolidated brackets or add a fourth. But, you know, isn't the main goal growth? And if you want a growing economy, you don't take more from people and give it to government bureaucrats. You allow people to keep more of their money and invest it in the real economy, not the government economy. Right. And that's my point. The, way, the plan is that everybody across the income distribution curve would get a tax break. And the main issue is here, we not only want consumers to have more in their pocket, but we want business investing more. Right. The real lack in productivity growth in this country and faster economic growth is because we don't have a growth in investment. Yeah. And that's the real driver behind this tax reform. Congressman, just 10 seconds, state and local deductions, being able to deduct that from your federal tax form. Do you know anything about that? In high tax states, I think that's still being discussed with the committee. That in the state property tax issue you referenced, that is being looked at, and I think uh, we'll reach a conclusion. And we want all Americans to benefit okay. from this tax plan. Reach a conclusion when, quickly? I think in the next couple of three weeks. Okay. Congressman French Hill, good to have you here, sir. Good, Thank you very much for being here. Appreciate it.